Hey guys. So, River and I are on a hike. And we are at, um, she keeps changing sides. We're at Grell Recreational Area in Spicewood, which is not very far from us. Um, and we are taking a nice hike. And River's trying to figure out what's going on. <laughs> doing so good. Unfortunately, right now she's got two massive horse flies. Let's see. I don't know if you can see them. That will not leave her alone. They feel really bad. Um, they are being nasty. Oh my gosh, we're being surrounded by horse flies. Ugh. All right. Well, let's keep going and hopefully they leave us alone. I feel really bad. Um, but yeah, so this is a couple mile hike. We're gonna go to the water, so Lake Travis, and which up here is the Pernouse River. And yeah, I'll check in with you guys later, but she's doing awesome. She loaded great, got into the trailer great, unloaded great, and has been doing fantastic since. And she's wondering what we're doing, just climbing this big old hill and downhills and all that stuff. But come on, girl, let's keep going. I know those horse flies are bad, aren't they? It's gonna take us forever if you eat the whole time. All right, so here's our map that we're following-ish. Come on, girl. Um, look how pretty it is. It's beautiful. Let's see, we are somewhere along Fox Run right there. We'll figure it out. Good morning, Texas. So, we have a decision to make. Continue on Fox Run. We'll go to Chaparral. I think it's how you pronounce that. Run. What do you think, River? Let's see, where is that? Oh, we're a little further than I thought. right there. Let's not get stuck in there. Come here, girl. Come on, let's find somewhere it's better to go in. Are you going to roll?
Okay, okay, come back. I hope you're laying down and not sinking. Oh girl, come on. Oh. Feel good? Get yourself cleaned up. Alright, so yours truly here went on a little swim. Got all muddy. But she feels much better. Thankfully the horse flies are leaving us alone now. Not sure whether that's because we're closer to the water or what, but once we got out of the brush, it uh, got a lot better. But... Now I'm trying to figure out where we are. Pretty sure we're right there next to Hawkeye Point. But the lake is so dry right now that we're pretty far away from, like I think that maybe is it up there, I'm not sure. We're gonna go straight back up, but I'm hesitant to go back up into the brush because of the horse flies. So we'll see. We may just track along out here and then cut in, but we take a little bit of a risk. Okay, so we found our way back. So far, I don't even want to say it, but there's no of those H word things around yet. Um, but we're back on the trail. We're heading back to the trailer, that direction at least. Wanted to keep today's hike fairly short for a couple reasons. One, I didn't bring a water pack for me. Two, this is River's first time out hiking, hiking. We've been on many walks before, but um, not like this, away from the other horses and longer distance. So, um, so she's doing fantastic, but I don't want to push my luck and I want to end on a good note. And um, we're both a little bit worn out and it's getting warmer. So, I mean, it's been a hundred and it's been in the 110 degree range by the middle of the day in Texas for the last couple of weeks, so um, we want to get back before we reach 110. Girl, we're almost done. We're almost back. Well, for a minute there, I was a little concerned <laughs> because I actually lost my map, which is great. Good girl, River. Um, but I was pretty confident. I kind of knew the direct. I mean, I knew the direction and the general idea of where we were going, so I wasn't too worried. But note to self: pick up more than one trail map if available, just in case. Come on, baby. I oh, know. I'm almost tired too. You got this, come on. What'd you find? Come on. Good girl. Such 
such a big girl. River is doing so well. Um, I've brought I've brought some adult horses here, uh, and they haven't done nearly half as well. Now, granted, we were riding, um, but we ended up walking half of it because um, they were tired, and they've literally just stopped in the middle of the trail, and we're just like trail, and we're just like, nope, we're not going anymore. Um, so we just got off and walked. It wasn't a big deal. They were. Uh, hadn't been out on trails in a while and so hopefully I'm hoping to make it a little bit more regular and River has had quite the learning experience today. I'm finding she's very sure-footed which is awesome and I hope to do more of this. trailer. River is loaded up. We're heading home. It's only a few minute drive. Um, she, it was quite the challenge to get the rest of the hike back. Um, once we started hitting those hills, it was, uh, it was lots of coaxing, lots of waiting, lots of please horse. We're almost there. She just didn't believe me. But once she, she saw the trailer, it was really funny. She saw the trailer and she's like, okay, cool. And she just went, We op I opened the door, I didn't even pause, I just sent her right in and she's like, okay, thank God we're going home. So um, we are on our way home, it's only an 11 minute drive home, so that's perfect. Since there's no water here, no water sources besides the lake, which is, you know, miles away. So um, that's what we just hiked to. So there's no, so you need to bring your own water. Um, but we didn't bring any because we're so close to home. So I'm going to get her home, get her rinsed off, get off all those fly bites and, or the blood from the, uh, from all that, and then, um, and get her and all the sweat off and then put her back up and she'll have plenty of water and rest for the, for the next while. And that's it. I'm, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one.